doesn't matter how the table is set up, you just have to put your opponents through it. It's about doing whatever it takes, upping the ante in a chaotic environment because it could be the mayhem that saves you. One move is all it takes to be the difference between putting your opponent through a table and being the one taking that painful ride through solid wooden metal. Lands a body shot. These tables matches really have the potential to get out of hand fast. Wouldn't you? Oh, God, that, that, that's a bad landing. Tempted fate and paid dearly for it. That haphazard approach definitely proved costly. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. He's looking for an implement of destruction under the ring. I could already feel the sting of the kendo stick, and I do not care for it. Oh, what an intense striking combination. We are European uppercut. Neck breaker. Uh-oh. Able to parry that one. Oh, directly to the face. In full control here. Face for on the leg sweep and oh, an overhand punch. He's in deep, deep trouble here, but maybe not able to slip out of things in a couple of them. Hands right to the mat. I can't begin to imagine what he's got planned here, guys. Maybe it's a yard sale. Oh my God, look at this. They're setting him up. Double suplex. What a devastating maneuver. In a match like this, sometimes the smartest strategy is to find an ally. It can also be the most dangerous if you don't watch your back. Great counter. Oh, and a knee. And another. Endless knee strikes. And with an onset of strikes like that, it's clear they have nothing but punishment on their mind. Oh, off the rope. Oof. Beautiful shot block. And after that shot to the knee, what could be next? position to be in right now. Ooh, right to the throat. Hook them up. And a suplex. That looks like setting up for a suplex. And to finish things off. And the official calls it clearly they cannot fight any longer. Here is your winner.